Dino here, uh, back for a, another commercial beer review and today I am going to be reviewing the Batch Brewing Dusk Rider Red IPA uh, it's a 500ml bottle, 6% ABV um, now the reason I've picked this and I've been looking forward to trying this I uh, haven't had a full bottle but when I was down at the Beer Barna Beer Festival in Wellington um, a couple of months ago I had a taste of this beer and it's one of the beers that stuck in my mind that I enjoyed from the festival. So recently on Facebook I saw that they were doing tastings of Batch Brewing's beer um, at a local liquor shop, Manly Liquor, up at Whangaparaa. And luckily enough the uh, owner and head brewer, uh, Craig Cooper, uh, from Batch Brewing was there. So I had a nice chat to him and he uh, seemed like a really nice, nice guy. Uh, keen to keen to chat about beer, and um, yeah, I tasted a few of their beers, and uh, but this is this is the one that I was really keen to buy. So here it is here. The the artwork on all their bottles is is fantastic. Um, nice depictions of New Zealand um, uh, beach scenes, and a batch is like a another name for a holiday house uh, near the beach. We call them batches here. Um, so yeah, let's. Uh, I'll crack it open, then I'll tell you a bit more about the beer. So it's got a nice hiss off the top. Got my uh, IPA glass here. So this should fit the entire contents of the bottle in here. A little bit of luck. Maybe not quite. There we go. Close enough. So yeah, it's poured up um, beautifully well. A couple of fingers of head there, nice and creamy on the top. Some nice carbonation coming up. And uh, if I hold it to the sun here and let some light through, it's a very, very nice red slash um, dark burnt orange slash copper. Uh, there's definitely some nice red hues coming through. So that's the beer, I'll just read what's on the back of the label. Um, so it said, at the heart of batch brewing is our passion for craft beer and, and our love for the Kiwi batch. Escape, freedom, simplicity and time together with family and friends. Dust Rider is brewed with specialty malts for a ruby red hue and a hot forward mix of tro tropical fruits and citrus from US Cascade, Amarillo, Citra and Nelson Salbin. So there's some really nice, uh, nice combo of hops there. So, yep, Ooh, the head's, uh, head's definitely staying there. Sorry, not, probably not the right thing to do, but um, just get rid of some of that foam. So yes, straight away, even though there's, there's quite a bit of head there, I'm picking up those citrus, citrus hops. Some nice, um, nice malt aroma, a bit of sweetness as well. It smells very nice. We'll uh, we'll dive in, guys, and um, see how she tastes. See if it's as good as what I remember. Yep, that's how I remember it. It's a real like tropical fruit um, bowl of uh, hop flavour there. Those uh, those hops um, that have been used give that real nice mix between uh, citrus and tropical fruit um, hop flavour. Picking up a little bit of um, caramel from the from the malts, but the hops are definitely um, the star of star of this beer. Um, like it says on the label, it's a hop hop forward beer. Super super um, like fresh tasting. Um, it's like. To me, it's like some. This is what summer, summer in a glass is, is meant to be like. It 
tasting it like a little bit of um, like biscuit as well um, from the malts. Yeah, so a little bit of caramel, a little bit of tiny bit of sweetness, and some nice biscuit. Um, and it's got some really nice um, lingering bitterness to finish with. Um, yeah, it's a very very nice beer, and um, reminded me of why I enjoyed it so much at the Bivana Beer Festival. Yeah, not a lot more else to, else to say really, apart from it's a very nice red IPA. Everything you want, plenty of flavour, nice bitterness, lots of hop, hops coming through. So that's me done guys, I'll stop uh, um, jabbering on. So yeah, if you're interested or if you see it, that's the Batch Rider Dust Rider Red IPA. I can highly recommend it, I don't think you'll be disappointed with that at all. Until next time, um, and enjoy your day, and we will catch you next time. Cheers, guys. Over and out. Yeah.